Hey what is up guys Johnny here back with more Call of Duty Mobile in today's video we play ranked multiplayer with randoms I know it's not a great idea apparently if you play with randoms there's a chance that they will fill your team with bots if we cannot find a teammate and there's a very high chance that you're gonna play versus full squads and the squads are pretty stacked seems like the matchmaking is a bit broken lately I've been facing a lot of very high ranked teams even if I was not with really high ranked players. So we're gonna see what we get today. I'm gonna go with the PDW57. It's a pretty good SMG for PVP. Uh, we're gonna go with Blast Vest, trying to survive a little bit. And also Hardwire, guys. You kinda need Hardwire. If you're gonna play rank, it's filled with trip mines. It's a freaking mess out there. Trip mines everywhere. So Hardwire, you're gonna, like, not gonna trigger the trip mines at least. It's gonna give you a chance to survive and not having to look for them and for the third perk i'm going with hardline i don't know what you guys use leave me a comment below uh any suggestions for uh, perk number three but let's go and queue with randoms and fingers crossed for a good squad got team dead match on hijack so team dead match guys once again uh it's all about staying alive try to have a positive ratio and if your whole team has a positive ratio, it's going to be a win, right? You don't want to be the guy with one death or one kill in like five, six, seven, eight deaths. If you cannot kill, maybe try to stay safe, maybe. So let's go on the right side and maybe grenade out there. We can win this. We can win this. Lost the lead. Oops. My aim at the start. There's a dude in there. It's too close. Fight hard. Oh, I got sniped in the back, but we're two and one at least. And the game is close. Three, three to three, four to three, we're ahead. It's not the best weapon for long range. But it's got a very high fire rate and very good damage. Nobody here. Oh yeah, I forgot to talk about the score streaks. Usually when I play rank, I go with cheap score score streaks that you don't need a very, very high streak. Because uh, it's not bots. Or maybe there will be bots, but it's not filled with bots like when you play casual. And it's not likely you're gonna get these crazy score, score streaks like 20 kills. Come on, let's go. There's a dude up there. These guys with the nades. Friendly hunter killer drone. No, deployed. sniper dude. UAV recon is so UAV? By. UAV online. Spawning the other other side, right? Uh, it's looking good still. Oh, yeah, we're way ahead. Hunter killer drone ready for deployment. Sniper down. Hunter killer. Hunter killer drone deployed. The sniper Objective dude. Almost complete. Keep it up. Sentry gun ready for deployment. I got sentry gun. I wait and see where they spawn, because if they spawn on the other side, there's no point. I also got my dead machine. Yeah, looks like they are gonna spawn there, right? Hopefully, they don't spawn behind. Oh my god. I think they split. All right, we got this, guys. Four, 40 to 13 is the score. And I got lucky, I think, with the matchmaking. Because honestly, guys, last few times I played ranked, it was a freaking mess. And I'm really close to ranking up, by the way. I'm veteran 3 right now. And I was 19 points away from, uh, I think it's Elite 1. Right? 
you go we got 21 points and it's gonna be elite one rank ranking up 1202 and it's 1200 out of 1400 it's 200 points to rank up at this level now the reward you get for ranking up to elite one is the blue marine grenade at rookie three i already got the marine dagger and rookie two i got the marine blue uh, magnum so that's pretty cool but there's still a long way to go i'm gonna have to rank up three more times to get the ak-74u and after that it gets pretty crazy guys because i just noticed it's not it's no longer 200 points to rank up after pro one it's 300 points to rank up and instead of three levels it's four levels you have to go to master one so pro one to master one is a freaking grind but the reward is a blue marine sniper so i don't know if i'll be able to go all the way up there but i would really like to get at least the ak now the score streaks i use was uav and hunter killer hunter killer i mean i know it's not the most popular but it's almost a free kill and in team that match it could make a difference and it's very cheap uav i like because it's gonna help the whole team you want to win you want your team to win it's not an individual uh, achievement to get the most kills you want your whole team to do good now sentry gun i don't get it that often especially not in ranked but it's a very good score streak it's a bit op maybe it's a bit too cheap uh, we'll see if they nerf it in the future but there's a lot of discussions on the sentry gun right now on the social medias so guys that is it for today hope you enjoyed the short video leave a like if you did leave a comment below give me some tips for ranked pvp and i will be back soon with more call of duty mobile don't forget to subscribe to the channel i will be back soon till then watch my other videos take care